Hey Capricorns, I'm back, I'm back, I'm back. Glad to be here with you guys. I just put you guys' energy and for some reason I could not get the video to upload. So I'm reloading a new video. Um, I did not like the energy from the previous read. It just seemed as if you guys are like going through something emotionally. Um, and let's see if, you know, what, what message is here. Okay, let's see what's going on. I feel like you guys need to trust your intuition on something, okay? I feel like you guys aren't trusting your intuition on something. And I feel like you guys need to trust that inner feeling that you get, okay? That feeling that you get that's telling you don't do this or don't make this move. I feel like you guys need to trust that, okay? So let's see what message we have for you. If you are um, new to this channel, welcome, 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 welcome. Don't forget to click that bell to subscribe. Don't forget to like, share with your family and friends, and comment below, all right? So these messages can be vice versa. This can be your energy or someone around you or the op their, your partner, something to that nature, okay? Um, if you would like to purchase the extended version to this reading, that information is going to be below, okay? So let's jump into it, okay? What message is there for Capricorn? At the bottom of the deck, we have the nine of wands in reverse, okay? So, maybe you have dropped your guard, okay? I feel like some of you have dropped your guard on something, okay? I feel like you guys could be unhappy in a situation, okay? Something is not, you know, bringing you emotional fulfillment. We got the ten of cups in reverse, okay? You feel... Like, you need to go about things in a different way, okay? And I feel like an opportunity is there for you to change things up. Um, but are you going to take that opportunity? I feel like you are restraining yourself or holding yourself back, okay, from making some type of move, okay? You guys should come out of a situation, okay, a stagnant situation. Come out of stagnancy, okay? Okay. We have the Seven of Pentacles. The Hermit in reverse. The Emperor in reverse. The Eight of Pentacles, okay. The seven of wands in reverse. And the ten of wands. So something is very, very heavy, okay? I feel like you have invested in something. You're working towards something, but I feel like you may have given up on it in the past, okay? You may decide, like, you know what? I don't even want to fight for this anymore. Okay, I don't even want to fight for this anymore. Okay, you may feel like you don't have control over the situation. So you don't really know how to go about it. And I feel like moving ahead, you guys, with this Ten of Wands, this shit is heavy. It's heavy. It's something very heavy um, going on here. Okay. You could be dealing with the Virgo. I got Aries' this energy here as well. Leo, Sagittarius, Aries, as well as Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn. Okay, so let's dig into this. Let's see what is what, okay? What's going on here? I'm not going to be too focused on shifting the cards. I more so want you guys to get the message, okay? 
So with the seven of pentacles here, you've invested in something that you have no control over, okay? Maybe you're being patient, you're waiting something out to see how something is going to work. Um, why is the seven of pentacles here? Queen of pentacles. You guys, it's energy, okay? But there is a sense of not being stable, okay? Maybe you feel like a situation is unstable, okay? Why is the hermit here? So you've decided to distance yourself, okay? Why is the hermit here? Ooh, I, I'm definitely sensing that there's some spying going on, okay? So maybe you're watching from afar, okay? We got the Queen of Cups, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. We got the Two of Cups, which is about a bond or connection that you have with someone, okay? A relationship that you have with someone, a connection. I feel like this is someone from your past or a situation from the past that you don't have good memories of, okay? We got the Six of Cups in the reverse. When you look back on this situation, you don't feel, you don't see anything, uh, you know, you look at it in a negative light, okay? If something did not go as planned. Two of Wands in the reverse. Something did not go as planned, okay? A situation was supposed to be temporary, okay? Some of you guys are dealing with a Leo. We got the Sun card in reverse as well as the Strength, okay? Why is the Eight of Pentacles here? Okay, Five of Pentacles in the reverse. Okay, so you've tried you've tried to come out of this situation, okay? But just something just just is not fair, okay? Something is not just something is not fair. You could be dealing with the Libra, but you just feel like this situation is just not right, okay? Something about it is just not right. You could be dealing with a Cancer, okay? So you're trying to figure out how to move forward and get things done the right way, okay? But I feel like things are just unclear. You're unclear on whether or not if you should take a risk, okay? You're not sure how to get a new start in this situation, okay? Seven of Wands in the reverse, you 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 dropped the situation in the past, okay? It's like a lot of you may have given up on a situation, okay? Why is the Seven of Wands in the reverse? Uh-huh, the Fool, Okay? This is about something from your past that was not victorious, okay? Something that did not go the way it was supposed, you thought it would go, but it did. something did not go as planned, and you don't feel victorious in the situation, okay? And you're, you're tired, and you're ready to take a break, and you need some time to think, okay? There's an offer, there was some type of offer on the table with this Knight of Cups in reverse, but I feel like you did not take the offer, okay? Why is the emperor here in the reverse? This is the father of the tarot, okay? So some of you guys could be dealing with a father or baby father or something to that nature. But we have, you know, the emperor is about having control. With it being in the reverse, you don't feel like you have any control. You can't, you don't have any control over the situation. Why is the emperor in reverse? Five of cups in reverse. There's regrets. That things did not go as planned, okay? Queen of Wands, Leo, Sagittarius, Aries, Energy. You want to take action, but you have to find a balance. This situation is just too imbalanced, and you haven't gotten a balance on it yet, okay? So the Ten of Wands for future energy is, you know, you're ready to let this go. You're ready to drop this because it's just too much. Why is the Ten of Wands here? Two of Wands again. No, this is the Three of Wands. I'm sorry. In the reverse. 
okay? Knight of Swords. I feel like you, you really want to rush in and just, you know, fix this. But I feel like there is emotional instability here. I feel like this is something that you really, really wanted. You had high hopes for it to work out. But I feel like something just did not work out. We got the lovers in the reverse. Someone was definitely a player here. You're dealing with the player or you guys are the player. We got the King of Wands and the Seven of Swords in reverse. So somebody was definitely, you know, being a little player here. And I feel like you're just, you know, done waiting on figuring this out. Why is the Three of Wands in the reverse? Ace of Cups in the reverse. Ten of Cups in the reverse as well as the world in reverse. There is unfinished business here. Okay. There's unfinished business here. There's an opportunity, you know, getting ready to come up. We got the Queen of Cups, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. I feel like a opportunity is getting ready to present itself a new fresh opportunity but i'm not sure if you're going to take it okay i'm not sure if you're going to take this offer okay i don't i'm not sure if you're going to take it why is the queen of cups here I feel like you've been waiting a long time Okay, well, we got the Three of Cups, okay? Something about the past, going back to the past. Three of Cups is reconnecting, okay? Reconnecting. Why is the Three of Cups here? Four of Swords. So you're thinking about reconnecting, okay? You're holding back, okay? You're holding back with the strength card. You really don't have that courage. You really don't have that boldness in you to actually, you know, go towards this person. We got the Queen of Swords, which is Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. Four of Wands is home life, okay? Stability. So maybe you are... Um, for some of you guys, this is about a living arrangement. This is about home life. This is about a family. This could even be a marriage, okay? But I'm picking up no. I'm picking up a no, okay? We got the Ace of Wands in the reverse. This is clearly a no. No new start. No new beginning. I feel like there's something here about Queen of Swords, Libra, Gemini, Aquarius, Four of Wands, um, home life, okay? You guys are trying to move. Maybe you are physically moving. Or there is definitely like a, a, a moving on to calmer waters. But I feel like you don't trust. Your intuition is telling you where to go, how to go about it. But I, I don't feel like you're trusting your intuition. Maybe you're talking to your family. Okay. Ten of Pentacles in the reverse. Eight of Wands. Maybe you are discussing things with your family. Okay. Or whether or not to go back towards something. Okay. It's definitely about running back to something. Okay, but like I said, with the Six of Cups, the memories are not good. You don't have a good feeling about it. You don't have, like, the memories of it. It's just, you don't like it, okay? You don't, you don't like it. You don't like it. Okay, so let's see what action, what action should Capricorns take?
All right, we got the King of Swords and a Three of Pentacles. All right, I feel like with the King of Swords, this is someone that's very stern, knows exactly what they want, and strategic, okay? With the Three of Pentacles, this is about being strategic in how you move, okay? So you, I feel like you have to be very strategic, okay? You have to make the, the your best, your next move your best move, okay? See, look, we got you being uncertain, okay? But this could also be a no. And and to be honest, guys, when I pulled you guys' energy previously, um, I just kept getting no. Postpone. Wait. Yeah, see? Two of cups in the reverse. Ten of cups. You giving up. I don't feel like you want to give up though. I don't feel like you want to give this relationship up. I feel like you may feel like you've invested into this. I feel like you feel like you invested, okay? And you thought that you were going to see some type of growth. Okay? But look, it's something it's not going to work. Okay? It's not going to be successful. It's not going to be successful. Okay. Why is the six of wands in the reverse? The magician. See, look. The death card, the three of cups, and the two of pentacles. Someone is juggling, first of all. Someone is juggling. I'm not sure if it's you guys. But someone does, I feel like someone doesn't want to give up someone here. We got the two of pentacles. I feel like someone can't make up their mind who they want. The magician, the two of pentacles, the three of cups. Okay. I feel like someone can't make up their mind on what they want to do or who they want to be with. And you're not sure... What's taking so long? You're not sure if you should wait. This is about someone from the past. What message do you have for Capricorn? What message is there for Capricorn? Protection. This is for your own protection. I'm telling you. This is for your own protection. I just feel like trust your intuition. Okay. Trust your intuition. Okay. <laughs> okay. So take time alone before you take some type of leap of faith or you take some type of action. It's time to think about it. Think about it first before you leap, okay? Think about it first before you leap, all right? If you would like to purchase the extended version to this reading, if it resonated with you, um, that information is in the drop box below, okay? Like this if, you, if this message resonated. Don't forget to comment and share with your family and your friends, all right? And until my next time, my loves, child.